All right, guys, so today we're going to be talking about some basics for mixed martial arts. And basically, it's going to be the back control and showing you guys some very beginner level stuff when you have the back, how to control so you don't lose the position and how you can attack. One of the most classic chokes we have, which is the rear naked. Okay, so um, let's start with the position of your legs. So these are called hooks. I want to have my hooks behind my opponent like this, but there's two things that you don't always see on camera, so when you practice, you want to make sure you have. Number one is you want to have your knees pinching against his body, and number two is your heels are driving towards the ground like this, okay? So it makes everything tight. Now you can control the lower portion of his body. For the top portion now, what I want to do is having my arm underneath the armpit as such, okay? And now the other one is going to come across. Now the one that goes across the neck, notice how I'm going to have the wrist right onto his chest right here. So the wrist goes down and the other one latches right on top, just like this. So now we have a good seat belt control behind our opponent. The reason we want this is no matter where he's going to go, whether it's the right or the left, I'm always like a backpack behind my opponent. Now from here, we can easily go and attack the neck. So what we're going to do is one, we go and grab the shoulder take this one out, stay tight, and notice how my hand is going to connect to my bicep as the other hand goes and finds its way behind the head as such. And now from here, you have what we call the rear naked choke. All right, so this is a great technique for uh, mixed martial arts. This is a jiu-jitsu technique. Uh, mixed martial arts really are composed of boxing, wrestling, Muay Thai, and jiu-jitsu, right? So the jiu-jitsu aspect is a huge aspect of mixed martial arts fighting. So once again, remember, the hooks, knees tight, heels tight, the seat belt or the pummeling of your hands around his body as such, the one that goes underneath the armpit stays here nice and snug, and this one goes against the chest, latches on, you have this type of control now. From here, you can easily attack, see? This one goes around the neck, can either reach his shoulder, or your own if your arms are long enough. And now take this one out, slide through, and now put your head beside and sink in what we call the rear naked choke, okay? So these are just some basic stuff for you guys to keep in mind the next time you have back control and how you apply the rear naked. Now there is one important point when you have your legs around like this, don't cross your feet as such. Okay, if I cross my feet as such, it's easy for him to bring one leg over and foot lock me just as such, and then break my ankles if he bridges. So I want to keep my, my legs one beside each other as such, okay? Even if they're a little bit higher like this, that's fine as well, okay? But never cross your feet. All right, so there you have it. Quick technique for MMA. Guys, leave us a thumbs up and subscribe for more videos just like this one. Until next time. We'll see you guys in the next MMA video. Take care.